Group 24 is the group that will be moving parts of the Patriot weapon system to Poland today, to the eastern flank of NATO, precisely to the location of Samos, that is in the foreign area of Poland. There we have been assigned a protection mission which we will undertake with the Patriot system. A total of three Patriot weapon systems will be moved to Poland. The first two will march from here shortly. The third will follow soon. The Poles have already been preparing for a fortnight. We also already have a command on the ground which will prepare the takeover for us. This means that the infrastructure has been prepared, accommodation has been provided and it has been ensured that we have sufficient food and control systems on site. Poland will take care of the security. That means we are looking forward to working with our Polish allies there on the ground to ensure the protection of NATO airspace and also the integrity of NATO airspace. But how quickly the conflict between Russia and Ukraine can spill over to NATO member countries? when the two Polish citizens were killed by a missile, that is certainly one of the reasons why Germany will now support NATO's eastern flank in Poland with Patriot. As you already know, we took on this mission in Slovakia last year in March to ensure similar protection. And this will now also be the case in Poland in the near future. But we are not the only defense forces on the ground. The British and Americans are also on the ground. Now we are joining them and can ensure that NATO airspace is protected and with it, the Polish territory, the infrastructure, but also the population there. Patriot is a strictly defensive system and we hope that we will be able to provide sufficient protection there to prevent attacks or accidents like the one in November in the future. We will now have a second area of operations with Poland in addition to Slovakia. And the training of the Ukrainians on the Patriot system is also running in the same time. Therefore, it only makes sense at the moment that this development in Poland will be limited to six months and then we will have to see how it will continue in the future with two operational areas and the training in Ukraine. For the men and women, it is certainly a strain at first, but in the end, it is precisely the skills for which we have been trained that we can now use to support our allies in Poland. Well, I have to say that it fills me with pride when I see the men and women here, how they have prepared the weapon system for the deployment, now also to successfully start the mission and then also to carry it out and then to bring it to a conclusion and to make a really meaningful contribution to the protection of our allies and ultimately also of Germany, we must not forget that. In der gesamten Flag natürlich guckt, was gerade einsatzbereit ist und mischt es dann. So we are proud and happy that it is starting, that we are finally allowed to go, can go in order to show what we can do on the weapon system on which we have been trained for years and to show the world that we can rely on Germany and the Patriot weapon system.